Mr. Paul Botts is a nationally recognized blogger. He's a keynote speaker. He is the um, founder and creator of the Good Leadership Concept. He's an author, and it's always a pleasure. Paul. Thank you. Thank you. Wow, it's winter in Minnesota. Sometimes what we do is to just state the obvious, and the obvious is it's really important when you live here in winter to make up, wake up in the morning and make the decision to be happy. I think what's so satisfying about what we've created here is that this is a room full of people who get that concept. What can we expect from you in the future? And that's the second question that I hate to ask, prob uh, answer probably even more than, you know, uh, what makes a good leader, is I, I have no idea. I really have no idea. I have never had any idea. People like me, and there are a few of us out there, plan for our clients, we plan for our companies, but we don't necessarily plan for ourselves. So over the years, I've had to make peace with that. Um, or maybe in a few years, I'll get on Teresa Daly's calendar and we'll have it out. But, uh, uh, but, and I don't know if I'm really, I don't know if I'm equivocating with myself or if this is truly where I am and where I've always been, but I'll just lay it out to you. There's a saying that chance favors the prepared mind. And that quote happened to originate with Louis Pasteur, pasteurization, the scientist who made more mistakes you know, than he, than he made successes. So I've carried that with me. Chance favors the prepared mind. Prepared in my definition meaning open mind. And then the second piece of how I'm not worried and why I'm not worried about the future is a Chinese character that I have mounted on my desk that I picked up when I was chaperoning a high school trip to China for my daughter. And the character is, uh, no it's not may you live in uncertain times or whatever that one is. <laughs> it is keep learning. Always keep learning. So I figure if I keep an open mind, I'm open to chance occurrences that probably aren't chance anyway, seven Fs, and keep learning, things will just fall into place. So maybe in five years I can tell you how that went, huh? I'm out. Thanks, everybody. Now you get to do the most this important so thing cool. that we do at the Good Leadership Breakfast. Uh, how much money did we collect today? Today we collected $2,088. And with the match, that will come to $4,176. Fantastic. Oh, yeah. There you go. Oh, my God. Outstanding. Well, that is incredible. Thank you so much. Fantastic. So now you get to draw the oh, name man. of the winner. Linda Ortner Smith, Chief Advancement Officer, Come on up here. Center for Children. Fantastic. Very cool. Hi, Linda. Well, good morning. Tell us. Washburn Center for Children. So mm -hmm. that's where the um, contribution will go. So thank you to each of you who made that possible. Fantastic. Fantastic. You're so welcome. Thank You're you. You're so welcome, Eric. We sponsor these events today uh, because of the dynamic people in this room and the energy you all bring to this event and because uh, we believe that good leadership is truly good business. Leaders that really create energy and excitement and loyalty and market and customer impact in their businesses or in their organizations, whether they be profit or nonprofit, they have a foundation that exhibits the seven F's. Medical science is amazing. I think there's a, a reason why the message that we have and the work that we do is so magnetic to companies like Alina and Health Partners and many others. The healthcare arena where people actually touch people understand seven F's in ways that are really, really powerful. Hey, it's winter in Minnesota. The best decision we make is to be happy. We hope you can be happy all the way till we see you again next month. We're really grateful that you're here. Have a wonderful week. I was inspired and I think I'll I think I'll be a better leader today for it. Network with people. It's a great experience. Just being here so positive and it, even if I don't remember the particulars, the spirit's been lifted and it's a great thing for the day. I like the camaraderie and I love the excitement here. The people are incredibly engaged and there's such a good spirit of giving back to the community, which is really important to me. Great opportunity to connect with people. It's a great reminder, I think, with the seven Fs, to take a look at those things and make sure that my wheel can roll. This is a fantastic speaker. The food is great. Uh, I've got to see some individuals I hadn't seen for a while. I got to make some new friends.